hey loves welcome back to my channel it's your girl miss eva thank you so much for being here i feel so lucky i met you and i still can't believe that i get to see those eyes from both things and i swear you must have felt from the sky i feel so lucky i met you if you're new here if this is your first time karibu sana if you've been here before thank you guys thank you so much for supporting me so we moved as you all know and i just want to go straight to the point um it's been it's been a few weeks since i uploaded a video yeah and i want to say a long time no see but you know we've had that statement here so many times but anyway i'm so glad to be back um I was just going through, I don't know, I don't know what I was going through, like, I, I was demotivated from posting content, I I just can't explain it, um, but I don't know, maybe it was burnout, fatigue, and, you know, I just needed, you know, some space, again, I have, a, I have another full-time job, and I have so many other things going on that may have taken my attention, but anyway, we thank God for a video, yeah? <laughs> We thank God for our video. Yeah, so I wanted to share with you guys my moving process and show you my house as is at the moment. And I think I was waiting for like this, what do you call it? this grandiose, <laughs> grandiose house tour. Like, you know, I have everything in place and yo, that is not happening anytime soon. Like soon, maybe soon soon maybe from next year but not like you know yeah you, you get the point yeah so i'm gonna show you the house as is it is my home it is my safe space it is my happy place and i'm so grateful to god that i can actually live in um, a bigger house yeah coming from a, a bed sitter a studio apartment that i have been in for about a year and seven months or so seven months eight months or so and now moving in into a bigger space god did it yeah god god did it for me anyway guys i moved i moved it's been now three months i believe three months or in the fourth month december is the fourth month that i'm actually living in this space if i am not wrong i mean it's three months yeah because we moved september october november yeah if i'm not wrong yeah if i'm not wrong <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm getting lost anyway it's been a couple of months in my new space and um i moved i moved with movers this time around it was my very first time using movers i was not ready to start lifting um couches and the fridge and the bed i just wanted baby girl treatment convenience yeah so i moved with movers i used octa octa movers and before i settled on these movers i really like requested for quotations from several movers that you know i had seen um advertising their products and services um online and of course i was you know going to those that i have seen have been used by other people before so i was looking for the reviews and also looking at the budget and for my space what i found was because i was moving from a bed sitter to a, a two-bedroom house um the the quotes were relatively the same to be honest there wasn't much of a difference between the different quotations that i received if anything the difference was like a thousand or two thousand bob and so it was very very easy i settled on octa movers because they came affordable like i think with a thousand or so and i saw that they have the same they're offering the same services with the other with the other um uh, companies that um that i had requested for quotations from yeah so we moved i'm telling you these guys were on time like literally they were calling me uh they had said that they'll be there by 8 a.m in the morning they were there at 7 20 they were calling me i think i was either i was i don't know i had woken up but you know i wasn't like really woken up i'm just you know hanging around on my phone nini, nini. and then i hear to go up a chini we are down here i'm like yeah these guys are on time so anyway uh, they come in and they basically just packed up everything and i'm going to show you in a few um 
um, in a few, they packed up everything, wrapped things that needed to be wrapped, things were put in boxes, like literally we were seated the whole time. I was taking my cup of tea. Literally, we did not lift a finger. Everything. What you can do is, um, if you happen to use movers, what you can do is just that you can secure like valuable items first and like put them in a bag that you want to carry, like your laptop, like you know anything sensitive, maybe even perfumes that you do not want. You know, you just you just, you just don't want them to land in the wrong place. Any valuable item, whatever valuable means for you, you can like put them in a bag separately and in that bag you're the one who's gonna carry it but the rest of the items they come and do everything they go to your kitchen yeah you don't even lift, need to lift a finger they will remove all the cutlery all the the crockery all the cups and everything from um where they are pack them up in boxes even they have a cooler box for like your fridge like for the things in your fridge that you don't want to go bad if you have any meat if you have any greens whatever you have they have a cooler box and they put everything from the fridge they put them in um the cooler box so that was really 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 good even clothes they just literally took them from the hanger pulled them and then just with the hangers themselves because we katukwa but boxes and so i never did a thing they just came did everything and off we went to our new place and what they do is that um i realized that uh they try to sort of like um okay when you're there when you're at like your new place they will ask you like where you want things to go but I saw as if they, they didn't even ask a lot of questions, to be honest. It's like they had sort of like mastered, <laughs> they had sort of like mastered where things were and tried to put things the way they, 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 they re, the way they recalled like from the previous place. Anyway, I mean, it was, it was, it was interesting and they did, they did the unpacking. So of course they may not unpack like the way that you would eventually like let your space be like let's say in the kitchen like maybe where they put the cups you would eventually change them but at least when you move like it's already you can literally sleep in that house you can cook that day and then you can start now packing things pole pole in the way that you desire in the in the places where you you want um them to go vile unataka so i found that really 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 cool um what else do they do some of them i think they also offer um they can install for you curtains as well though they cannot drill i think that's yeah cuz when i I don't know whether we we lost communication when I was reaching out to them because like I would also be installing curtains and my um I had gotten like new curtains and new rods curtain rods but when we got to the place um I think they said that's like a different um that was not in the package so I think I got it wrong because me in my head I was like they will also help with drilling like the holes for the curtain rods but what they meant is that they can like literally just put the curtains for you because you know curtains are usually high like they will install for you like they, it doesn't mean that they will drill like the holes for you anyway that's besides the point um i really enjoyed uh the service I, I i feel like it was value for money they put things uh wherever they um if i mean i could i could of course even provide of oversight like if i wanted something to go in a particular place i could do that um but what i experienced is that it's like they sort of remembered where everything was like even the things that were going in my office um they really tried by the way and you know they dismantle like i have this like kirak where i have put things and then they had to remove all of that to to do the transportation and then when you go to the house they put them back in and they really tried they really like to they tried to put like my pens and my 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 stationery uh sorry um in the way that they recalled they were and so they really tried on that but all in all after they finished like doing the whole thing that was a ready house that i could sleep there and i could arrange my things pole pole yeah so anyway yes we did the moving and it was amazing so i hope you've seen like how the house you know looked like how we moved from the bed sitter to the new place and you know how everything was sort of arranged and i want to show you how the house looks as is uh, at the moment and as i was saying earlier like i think i don't know i was hoping for this grandiose moment where because the house is not finished and i really wanted like to do a lot like i re i want to make it home like 
it's it's a home right now but i want to make it homely you know <laughs> like there's so many things that i'd love to purchase and for me that will be a project 2024 for next year I'll just you know upgrade the house pole pole but as is it is livable it is my safe space as i mentioned and i love it so much um so what i eventually got to do is for the curtains because they could not um install them for me i ended up asking for a contact of you know somebody who has a drill or who does installation of curtains around the area so i talked to one of the caretakers there and I was able to get somebody to come and do the curtains for me. Um, I also got a new shower from uh, Tungsten Electricals. And um, I was specific when I was reaching out to them. I was specific with, because we have borehole water. So I needed options for borehole water and not too salty. Because it's not like very salty borehole water. But it's a bit salty. And so they were able to recommend to me the best um, shower head for that. And they literally just, when on the day we, we, we moved, that day, that day, that day, that's the day that they came that's the day or rather i requested them to to bring their sh the shower and they did and installed it and it's amazing that shower is so beautiful and so um i know that they can they can recommend different shower heads depending on the kind of water that you get even in salty places whole water fresh water whatever that is they would recommend the best um shower head for you and you can select depending on um what is affordable for you um what else did i buy i got new curtains from isili i think i documented this on my um uh, on my instagram so i went to isili hey hey do i have a contact but anyway i went to this mall it's called yare mall it is opposite royal mall royal mall is like a yellowish building and then right opposite there is yare mall there's like stairs that you go down and all like all the all those um suppliers are down there um i didn't go to my usual there's a time i got curtains prior or when i when i moved last year i didn't get curtains from there i just went looking around in the mall because wako wengi sana i went looking around for what i wanted because i was looking for something lighter um and something that depending on the type of theme that i choose for the house it can easily blend so that i'm now not looking for other curtains so that was what i was going for and i ended up choosing like a creamish curtain with like a golden detail um, i really loved it and i also selected shears and so yeah i got it from hey do i have i know i have a business card somewhere but anyway i think easily you will always get something good wherever you go um there are different suppliers for whatever budget that you have huta kosa you just need to like look around and shop around yeah so that's why i got my rods and i also got the curtains those are the two i think those are the only things that i bought i am um, and of course like bulbs what else did i buy i think bulbs um i was able to get somebody to um from right there to what is it called to like connect my washing machine good thing that there was an inlet and an outlet within the house so at least that was sorted and of course water electricity all of that is 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 inside there and fun story guys remember i left um my previous place because of the electricity right i kid you not my electricity bill right now is 2000 bob yeah those are the tokens that i have put in the last three months that three months that i have been there every month like 2000 bob and so that tells me that and yeah these people were stealing from me because if anything this is a bigger house um uh, i've not added any other equipment it's still the same and this is tokens by the way my previous place it was post pay and that is why i i that that's why they used to just generate their own invoices and bring them to us anyway so i feel like it was um it was a good move that i made even if it was radical and i was acting on an impulse um it is better than uh just having the feeling that these people or rather not being at peace in my own place because you're like these people are ex extorting me so anyway guys i will show you my space as is right now it is so beautiful and cute <laughs> has a long way to go on but for now 
it is perfect it is perfect 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 for me i have so many plans for next year for that house um and so like i, I you know i i I want to add a few more things here and there so that nikifika kwa nyumba na feel wow this is my space you know this is this is beautiful but all in all I just want to thank God because it would not have been possible without him um like you know, the the transformation journey that I have had this year has been amazing has been beautiful anyway guys i'll leave you to watch the house as is at the moment and i will end the video here don't forget to watch the <laughs> the uh don't stop the video don't stop watching right now like continue watching um to see how the house is at the moment but i just want to say thank you so much for supporting this channel for supporting me for watching my videos for encouraging me i really appreciate each and every one of you if you are watching this and you haven't subscribed please subscribe so that you do not miss out on any other video that i post and let me just wish you a merry christmas an early merry christmas just in case you don't get to hear um again from me for this year <laughs> merry christmas and a happy new year um yeah i'll leave you to watch the rest of the house tour and uh next year god willing we're gonna upgrade this space okay guys as we always say remember to thrive and not just survive bye bye Mwah. Hit the bells out, hit the bells from afar You are the brightest one amongst all the stars Thinking out loud, thinking over old friends I notice now it's been a while since they left No problem, we'll find out For now just live it over high Happiness was playing cards on his own Cut the lame part Get over feeling upset Nobody ever said that life would be fair No problem We'll find them For now just live it over high No blow my whole little world But you please let me in for the night Maybe for a few days Everything's alright Slow glow my whole little world Would you please let me in for a while Slow glow I should shake it up The whole the magic kind of the light No Things are right.